Welcome to Super Easy Recipes. Today I'll be making Limehead Meatballs, which consists of savoury pork meatballs slowly stewed until they are tender, moist and light. They are called Limehead Meatballs because they are said to resemble the stylized guardian lions which you can find outside Chinese temples and other buildings. Now Limehead Meatballs are often served during banquets such as for Chinese New Year, but they're pretty simple to make at home and ideal as an everyday easy family meal, especially if you pair the meatballs with rice or noodles. For the ingredients, you'll need some minced pork. Now you don't want the pork to be too lean, but I find that 20% fat is a good compromise. You'll need some Chinese leaf or Napa cabbage as it's also called. You'll need an egg, some spring onion, ginger, some sugar, and some corn flour. You also need some stock. I'm going to use a chicken stock cube. For the sauces, you'll need Shaoxing rice wine, light soy sauce, and sesame oil. Begin your prep by finely chopping the spring onion. Then, separate the egg white from the egg yolk. For this dish, we only want the egg white. Put the pork into a food processor and add the chopped spring onions together with some grated ginger. Add a good dash of soy sauce Together with a dash of Shaoxing rice wine, add the sugar, salt, and pepper, and then the sesame oil. Give the mixture a quick blitz. before adding the egg white. Then give the mixture another quick blitz until it becomes fluffy. And you're ready to form the lion head meatballs. Now the meatballs can be any size you like. Today I'm making fairly large meatballs at about 70 grams each. The good thing about this dish is that the meatballs can be made in advance. When you're ready to cook, dust the meatballs with some corn flour. And then fry the meatballs in a frying pan or wok on a high heat. Fry the meatballs for a few minutes until they become brown all over. When the meatballs have a nice colour to them, remove them from the pan and set aside. Then separate the Chinese leaf. You may want to discard the outer leaves. Carefully place the leaves into a casserole or clay pot so that the leaves line the bottom and sides of the pot. Then place the meatballs into the middle of the pot. and pour the chicken stock over the meatballs. Bring everything to a boil and then lower the heat and simmer on a very low heat for at least one and a half to two hours.
Give the meatballs a turn midway through, then cover and continue simmering on a very low heat. It is very important to simmer the meatballs on a very low heat because you want them to become very tender without falling apart. The meatballs have been cooking now for over an hour and a half and they should be extremely tender. You can serve them directly from the dish in which they were cooked. Just add rice or noodles. Alternatively, you can serve them in a bowl. The cabbage is said to represent the lion's mane, while the meatball represents the lion's head. And if you enjoyed this lion head meatball recipe, then do check out my channel, which has lots of traditional Chinese recipes made easy. And do subscribe for future super easy recipes.